to my channel. Now, if you'd watched um, a couple of videos ago, you would know that I had been in Scotland and I'd bought all my face masks and oh, a few other bits and pieces. Some of them, uh, another two items I did buy was the Ole Anti-Wrinkle Lift and Firm Deep Wrinkle Treatment. And that's it there, four ninety nine dollars from a shop called Savers. I also bought the Ole Anti-Wrinkle 2-in-1 one, one, Firm and Lift Anti-Wrinkle Booster with Firming Serum um, and Cell Renewal Complex. And that's it there, and that's that one there. So I got them, I got them from Savers. They were two ninety nine each, very, very cheap. Now, I haven't tried them yet, but I am going to try them. Now, I have bought, bought a few other bits and pieces, but you know, you can't try everything in the one day because I want to apply it to my skin. When I was in Scotland as well, when I got them, I also got these little um, um, makeup, what is it? Makeoff mitts. Now, I bought two. I have seen people using them, and all you do is add a bit of water and it's supposed to take off your makeup. So I'll, I'll, try, I'll try that out as well. Now, I was in TK Maxx today and I bought the Anti-Wrinkle Vitamin C Face Serum with Tyramic. Now, this is um, not tested on animals. It's gluten-free and all natural ingredients. And that's it there. And it's by, what's it by? Uh, Seed and Poppy. Now, I'm dying to try that. It's still in the cellophane, so we'll be trying it together. Uh, this one is also in the cellophane and this is anti-wrinkle retinol face serum and um, see if I put on my glasses that would really really help me out here um, and it has hyaluronic acid reservatrol reservatrol and vitamin E and this is from uh, I don't know where is it from Main Street I don't know, Main Street, Apricare, I don't know, maybe I'm saying that wrong, but that's it there, I'm sure you'll be able to tell me that I'm making an absolute mistake. Um, I also bought this, it's a, a day cream and it's got a collagen formula, so, and it's made in New Zealand, and it's basically, I'm just looking to see if it's cruelty free, but apparently it has, um, uh, Q10 and collagen uh, for softer, replenished skin and the directions is basically the same as, you know, for all your creams. Apply daily, evenly to the face after cleansing. Well, we know that. But I'm going to try this out and it also has um, uh, argan oil uh, in it as well, as well as collagen and uh, Q10. So, and this is from, who's it by? Ano, Alo. And the lower cream, you just must be thinking that girl should go back to school, she can't read. But um, that's what it looks like, if you can see that. That's the, yeah, that's the top of it there. Very shiny. So I got them. And then I went to um, Aldi. And remember, I was, I'm on about these uh, little collagen wipes and that they're great and they were very, very cheap. Uh, I went back for them. And these are also cruelty free, by the way. Um, I couldn't get them, they were all gone. That's the thing about Aldi. If you're not in there quick, anything that's a good seller is gone within a day or two. So I did get this, it's the La Cloup, La Cura, and it's the Skin Care For You Healthy Glow, and it's an exfoliating toner, 5% glycolic acid, aloe vera and ginseng. And so I got that, and it's, you know, it's, it's, it's a big, um, it's a big lot, it's 250 mil. And this one is also cruelty free. Aldi does, Aldi, yeah, Aldi does a lot of cruelty free. I keep getting mixed up with Aldi and Lidl because I go to both of them. So that is going to last me a long time. So we're going to check that one out as well because what I want to do is just try it on my skin. You know when you've got clean, dry skin and if your skin is a wee bit dry and you put something like this on, uh, sometimes it can be a wee bit nippy. So we don't want that. Could you feel like, oh, is that irritating my skin? So we don't want that. So this is my little things that I, that I bought. So we'll try the old face mitt. So I'll stick a bit of makeup on or something there. A bit of something on and we'll try this to see if it works. Now, do you know something? I think these were only a pound. Honest to God, a pound. So I bought two. Um, this one was €9.99 
from um, our, uh, TK Maxx. This one was also 9 99 from TK Maxx. This one was 7 euros from TK Maxx. This one was 4 euros 99 from Aldi. And uh, like I said, I bought these ones from Savers and I bought these ones from Savers and they were £4.99 each. So what we're going to do is, at the weekend, I'll take a couple of things, try them out, see how they feel on my skin. If they're good, you know, you could go to TK Maxx or if you're in the USA, I don't know about Canada, if it's the same name, TJ Maxx. So um, you might be able to find these products and um, they are a good price because normally for uh, retinols and vitamin C serums, etc., they're kind of hard to find here, and when you do find them, they're very expensive. So um, I normally send to Amazon for mine, but to be honest with you, by the time I pay the P&P, &P, it's the exact same price. Uh, well, it's, it works out expensive, and um, that's if they actually send to Ireland. A lot of places do not ship to Ireland, I don't know why. But that's the story. So I'm going to try them out over the weekend. So if you want to see how um, these items go, uh, you know, how they feel on my skin. Although you can't really give a, a good review unless you've been trying it. You, you need to do an empties review. So I might try that one of the times because it takes me that long to empty anything. Because I've got so many creams and lotions and potions that, you know, I'm going from this one to that one. It takes me forever. To actually empty a product that's why i haven't done my empties yet but anyway guys um that's it for tonight just a few wee bits and pieces that i bought from tk max savers and aldi and um if you like the video please like and subscribe and uh thanks for everyone who's watched and um i'll talk to you later guys you take care bye